All right, if you're watching this, you have this problem here. Your SD card will not click in, lock down. I guess it's it's not a very common problem. I read, read all the forms, couldn't find any way to fix it. People are saying, you know, send it back in, but it's 35 bucks. I mean, if you could fix it easily, why not? So I'll show you how to fix it with a lighter. Uh, what you want to do is, uh, you know anybody that smokes or you smoke, you sure you got lighters laying around, you want to take the safety out and then uh, I'll show you from there. I'll get it out quick and then I'll get back to you. Alright, got it out. See, it's just this little safety here. Don't worry, your uh, lighter's still going to work. You know, just that little piece out. So, the piece you want is that end piece right there. See those little pins sticking out? What you want to do is you want to cut off this long piece, cut off one of those pins, leave one of them on there, and kind of bend it out flat, you know, sort of like a 90 degree angle. Um, I'll do that and I'll show you. Alright, I don't know if you can see that. It's pretty small it's just that little piece yeah, it's not zooming in but kind of get the idea it's the there you can kind of see it there but yeah, it's just that little piece with one pin sticking out and then what you want to do is your Raspberry Pi see that little slot right there when you put your SD card in, you can see the part of the SD card and the spring thing going down. If you push it down all the way, there's that little gap right there. And what you want to do is you want to put that pin in that gap, and then it, it stays by itself with the pressure from the spring. But uh, I just throw a little tape on there, you know, just to make sure. And, uh,. I'll put it in, I'll show you what it does. Alright, I got it in there, so you can see, SD card is staying in place. You can, you can probably cut that big tab off if you want to and just use the, the little tab, but uh, this little tab is, the whole piece right there is pretty hard to uh, get in there. I don't know, it'd be pretty hard to get that tiny little piece in there. You use a needle nose or whatever, but but uh, that's what I came up with. I tried everything, you know, tried rubber bands, tried just taping it, and this was the best way I could find and the easiest, you know, because just had some lighters laying around. And uh, I'll cut to a video of me running it, showing you that everything works. Um, you want to be careful. I don't know. I don't know much about the SD card slot itself, but I don't know if there's going to be, you know, if you touch metal to metal or something. I don't know, but I'll plug it in and show you that it works, and you can try that at your own risk if you want to. It's pretty easy. All right, here it is, uh, running with the SD card fixed. Runs fine. Uh, haven't had any problems yet. Been watching some videos on YouTube, just making sure it works and everything seems to be working fine and just got it, you know, sitting here. SD card is in there. See if you can see that securely. I don't know if you can you can see the clip to the left there. It's not in the way. You know. <clears throat> I don't know. I'd probably have it in a box like this, just in case you gotta take it out. This is easy to get out. Um, my other cases, let's see. I got, this is the Pibo Poop, they call it. If you're gonna do that fix, I'd, you know, just in case it pops out, you gotta unscrew all, all these, you know, or like this one, you gotta unscrew it, where the raspberry Pi foundation one, you just pop apart, you can take it out, put another one in, or put some more tape on it, whatever you need.